Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Felicia, everybody calls me Flick. So, first video of 2021, I was hoping to have had this filmed a few days ago, but my kids have only just gone back to school to yesterday and today, so I haven't had a chance to do anything because it's impossible to do anything when they're here. But yeah, I, if you've been keeping up with my Instagram stories and stuff like that, and my Facebook, I put the first video of the year down to you guys. I let you guys all choose. You voted on multiple palettes. And the winner, or shall I say winners, were the P. Louise Going Solo and Winter Wonderland palettes. Um, I did have these up separately, but when I put it on my Facebook and I shared it into the Sausages group, which is Make Me Up Mrs. Patreon group, Missa herself decided to add this as a combination choice and then loads of people then agreed that that was good and in the final vote for the first lot uh, this was I think second in the votes um, and yeah this literally beat out the antidote palette by one vote so <laughs> yeah um, I'm tasked with coming up, coming up with a look using both so that's what I'm going to try and do today. Uh, I hope I'm just going on because it's actually really cold in my flat, which is incredibly unusual. Usually it um, is like ridiculously warm in here, but today for some reason it is really cold and I'm not sure why. So with that being said, let's get into the video. I will throw up some swatches uh, in the next slide. Okay, so combining the two, I'm actually going to use my black P. Louise base, but I'm not going to use it yet. If I've learned anything, it's to go in with the other colours first before doing that part. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the shade Don't Flake It, which is this darkest blue, and I'm going to take it on my little double-ended Primark brush. Um, I've just filled in my brows and I've put, I've carved it out with P. Louise base and I've brought it down a bit. So... Yeah, I'm going to put this through my crease and then start blending it out with the other blues and then go from there. Okay. Then I'm going to take fluffy brush mm -hmm. I swear I have another one of these in my brush pot somewhere yeah I use this one sorry okay so I've used that one then I'm going to use the shade use that one yeah I'll go in with wrap it up and then winter is coming Why do I feel like I've lost a brush? Mm. Yeah, I feel like I've definitely lost a brush. Maybe I'll take this one. Um, yeah, now I'm going to take the shade Winter is Coming. Place the brush somewhere. Yeah, scrap these on. Okay, I'm going to take the shade Candy Kisses, which is this really, really light blue. I'm 
Okay, I'm gonna quickly go in and re-intensify those colours. And then I'll go in with the base and the shade from the other one. Okay, now I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to take this little blush and I'm going to take my black base, so I'm just going to put my base all over my lid, I'm just going to dab it into this brush and disperse it a bit. So yeah, I'm going to put this all over my lid um, and then I will use the shade Ring Off, which is the darkest shade in the Going Solo palette. Take this brush, which is dry. I'm gonna take the shade Ring Off, which is the darkest one here. I'm gonna pat that all over. This is like a really, really dark charcoal color. It's not quite black, which is why I thought the base might help make it a bit deeper. Okay, so that's how that's looking. My battery's about to die. I'll be back in a sec. Okay, back. Um, I just found that for darkest blue, just slightly over the edge again. For now, I'm gonna leave that as it is. I may, may, use the Snow in Love duochrome shade shade um, over the top, but for now, I like it as it is. So, just gonna make sure that is all patted down. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna do the other eye. Um, I'm not gonna bother doing my under eye until I've done my base, uh, which I may film for another video because I have got a couple of new products to try. So I'll see you guys in a minute when I'm looking a bit more alive and human. All right, guys, I am done. I got a little carried away and forgot to press record. Um, when I did this under eye, but I just used the same shades that I used on my lid. Uh, went in with Ring Off for my inner corner. I used Betrayal, and then I used the same three here, and then that one here as well to blend out. Um, I used Ice Ice Baby on my brow bone, but I wanted to try and use one of the shimmers out of this one as well, so I used this one on my inner corner. I'm still kind of do I don't I about putting this on my lid. I kind of like how it looks, so I might try that out another day and use that as a topper. But um, yeah, this is the finished look. Uh, lip is my MUA Sincere Pencil and what's this? The Rimmel Stay Matte in Latte to Go. I picked this up the other day, it was reduced in Sainsbury's, like three quid, so I picked it up. But um, yeah, I uh, I actually really like how this looks. Thank you to Missa for suggesting this combination to make me challenge myself a bit. But um, yeah, I I actually really like this. I haven't I hadn't done a blue smoky eye yet. I've done pink and I've done purple. I've done like normal black and grey, but I haven't done a blue one. So at least that ticks this off of my list. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like the look I came up with. And yeah, if you did, do not forget to like, subscribe, smash the notification bell, leave, mm, pardon me, leave a comment down below. <laughs> um, I will link these in the description. Um, 
everything else like my socials which are up here are also linked in my description box along with patreon and amazon thingies words are hard today it's my first day here without no kids to just yap in my ear and shout and scream so um returning back to normal is strange but yeah i am gonna love you and leave you and i'll see you all in the next one bye Thank you.